Hello everybody, my name is Craig Bennett, and today we are going to get into another overview video for Eco Global Survival. In this video, we are going to be taking a look at the Blast Furnace. Now, as far as the skills goes, you need to have metalworking, and you need to have that up to level 4, and you need to go for steelworking just by doing the first level and steelworking. It will unlock the Blast Furnace. So from there, you also need to have an anvil and also a um, smithing tool shelf. So just keep that one in mind. Now, as far as a blast furnace, again, you will need to have an anvil to make this. And it takes 10 iron and 10 brick. Now, for default, it takes about one hour to make it. So just keep that one in mind. On top of this, you will need to have one brick chimney, and that takes two bricks in itself, and you make it through the quarry. And also, you need to have, uh, as far as the bricks goes, you need to have a kiln, and it takes one pitch and um, three stones normally in order to make one brick. Now, as far as the blast furnace itself, this is actually what it will look like. It is quite big. And in order to use it, you need to have a room that has a volume of 45. It may share one other crafting table in the room. And it must contain of 32 blocks of brick. It, it also, in order to use it, you need to have that chimney. And it needs to be at least about four blocks above the thing. And I'll show you that. In, the, in fact, let's show you that right now so as far as this goes the thing to note with the um, this is I made it a little bit bigger but up there is the chimney and it just needs to be a, up there and one of the problems that I was facing when I was trying to get the chimney to work is apparently um, you need to have the bricks flush with the actual uh, furnace so that's a big thing to keep in mind um, because I honestly thought that that uh, wouldn't have mattered since you got the back and all the other stuff. So you, you need to make sure that the bricks, the uh, one of them is flush with the top at least. Just real quick, the um, size of this is about five blocks high. So one, two, three, four, five. And it, it is one, two, three wide and about three wide as you see here so just keep that in mind um the brick needs to be on that six block right there but anyways now as far as the thing goes is once you put it in it will keep track of how much pollution you can put into the air or you put it into the air so for each um hour you're putting into 0.1 tons or 1 ppm i don't know what that means but as far as this goes it's very very low very minute and i'll show you a little bit more into this in two seconds now as far as the um making something it is very loud so let's go ahead and make about five sparkle and you can hear it's being fairly loud i have to actually lower the volume so you can actually hear me and also it creates the puff clouds right above it now this is what i mean by it being not so bad we got quite a few people on our map that actually has the ability to to do it and you can see how quickly it goes away if you actually take a look at the pollution it it, it doesn't go up at all um there's no spike. I don't know if this is not implemented yet. yet. Keep in mind it's uh, alpha version 5.4. Maybe this will change in the future. But as it is right now, see if we can actually put it up. So before I just turn it on, it was going away. It does this little pattern. Um, and, and it. what I found is you can have this thing running for three, four hours, whatever and within one hour or maybe slightly more maybe like an hour and a half this will be gone it will be clear um and i've had this 
out fairly far. I mean, like, you can look over here, and this person had it out the worst, and you can see that it, it, it's it gone fairly quickly. The only way I think this would actually cause any actual real problems, so keep in mind this is spread, the uh, only way I think this would cause any actual problems is if every single person on the map is running theirs for about 10 hours plus non-stop. So that should tell you something right there that um, these things are not really that bad at all. They look a lot worse as far as the smoke and whatnot, but it is not that bad at all. And um, this fixes itself. Um, so just keep that in mind. Now, as far as that goes, if you got any questions, anything else, then if, please feel free to let me know and I'll try and answer as quickly as possible. Leave a like, subscribe, share, and I'll see you in the next video. Hope you have a great day.